San Carlos de Bariloche, known simply as Bariloche, is a beautiful city located in the Patagonian region of Argentina that, with a population of 164,065 inhabitants, according to its last census, is also the most populated in the Patagonian Andes and the Black River province. Bariloche is the most visited tourist destination in Patagonia and one of the most visited in Argentina. This city receives around 2 million tourists a year, mainly in the winter season, and these mostly come from countries in Europe and North America. An interesting fact is that it is also the main destination for high school graduates traveling to Argentina and Uruguay. Its main tourist attractions are its natural reserves, which include lakes, mountains and lush forests, but mainly its outstanding ski centers, as this city is considered one of the most important ski destinations in the world and the largest in South America. It is also considered the second city with the best quality of life in all of Argentina, both for its natural environment, its diversity of economic activities and its security, but that's not all, because Bariloche is also recognized as the chocolate capital of Argentina. Here visitors can enjoy a wide variety of artisanal chocolate shops and factories, where they can try exquisite creations and enjoy the best of Argentine chocolate. For that and more today we will take you on an extraordinary walk through the beautiful Bariloche. Cathedral Hill is one of the most important tourist destinations in Bariloche. It is recognized as one of the largest and most popular ski centers in all of South America. With a height of 2,388 meters, the center offers a wide variety of slopes for all levels, from beginners to experts in skiing and snowboarding. It has more than 120 skiable kilometers and an incredible infrastructure for practicing winter sports. But in addition to its renowned reputation as a ski resort, Cathedral Hill is also ideal for winter activities such as sleigh rides, snowshoeing, and snowmobiling. The landscape surrounding the Cathedral Hill is simply stunning, with snow-capped mountains, lush forests, and crystal-clear lakes. From the summit, you can enjoy spectacular views of the Nahuel Huapi National Park and its surroundings. The hill has a great tourist infrastructure that includes a varied range of accommodations, restaurants, equipment rental stores and services for visitors. In addition, it has ski and snowboard schools for those who wish to learn or improve their snow skills. The Chico Circuit is a tourist route that runs approximately 60 kilometers around Lake Nahuel Huapi. This popular route includes stops at points of interest such as the Campanario Hill Viewpoint, the Leo Leo Peninsula, the Angostura Bridge and the Cantaros Waterfall. The Chico Circuit is one of the most popular excursions in Bariloche and can be done by car, bicycle or on foot. Along the route, you can see spectacular views of Lake Nahuel Huapi, the Andes mountain range and the amazing natural landscapes that surround them. In addition to the stops I mentioned above, you can also visit other points of interest such as Otto Hill, Lopez Hill and Leo Leo Municipal Park. This is one of the oldest and largest national parks in Argentina. It was created in 1934 and covers an extensive area of approximately 710,000 hectares. The park is famous for its stunning natural beauty, with a combination of stunning mountains, sprawling crystal clear lakes and lush forests Lake Nahuel Huapi. One of the park's main attractions spans more than 500 square kilometers and offers plenty of water activities such as boating, fishing and kayaking. This beautiful park is also home to a great diversity of flora and fauna, including emblematic species of the area such as the Andean condor, the Hummel or Patagonian deer, and the puma. In addition, it has a wide network of trails that allow you to explore natural landscapes up close, such as the trail to Tronador Hill or the route of the Seven Lakes. Victoria Island is located in Lake Nahuel Huapi. It is a place of incredible natural beauty, with a wide variety of landscapes ranging from beautiful beaches to forests and mountains. The island offers many outdoor activities ranging from leisurely walks to fishing, kayaking and boating. In addition, it houses a native fauna park and nature reserve, where you can see species of trees and plants native to the region. The famous Leo Leo Hotel is also located on the island, which is an icon of Patagonian architecture. The Swiss colony in Patagonia was founded in 1865 by a group of Swiss immigrants who were looking for new opportunities in Argentina. They settled in the province of Chubut, 
in the south of the country, and created an agricultural community that stood out for its production of apples and pears. This Swiss colony was an important center of development for the region, and its inhabitants contributed significantly to the economic and cultural growth of Patagonia. Over the years, they have maintained their Swiss traditions and customs and today, it is a very popular tourist destination, where visitors can enjoy the local cuisine, explore the beautiful natural landscapes and learn more about the history and culture of this beautiful community. A must-see in Bariloche, especially for chocolate lovers, it is the famous chocolate factory Fenoglio. This is a renowned artisanal chocolate factory that was founded in 1949 by the Fenoglio family and has become an icon of the city. At Fenoglio, you can find a wide variety of delicious handmade chocolates. From truffles and chocolates to chocolate bars and tablets, each product is carefully made with the highest quality ingredients and following traditional family recipes. La Chocolateria has become an emblematic place in Bariloche not only for the quality of its products, but also for its warm customer service and cozy atmosphere. It is a perfect place to satisfy your cravings and take with you a sweet memory of Bariloche. And so we have reached the end of our extraordinary walk through San Carlos de Bariloche. If you enjoyed it as much as I did, give us a like, subscribe to the channel and activate the notification bell so you don't miss all the extraordinary walks we have for you. See you next adventure!